What is up, risk takers? Welcome to the Kill Pete Strategy. I am Pete. I'm a top player in risk global domination. The daily release on YouTube. I do weekday streams on Twitch. And if you are interested in getting better at the game of risk, I invite you to subscribe to my channels. Come along the ride with me. Ladies and gentlemen, this is our 10th iteration on Spaceport Sigma. Uh, Spaceport Sigma. Progressive Capitals. I'm in the first seat playing as red. All right, so I have an okay cap spot here. Um, but that gets locked on a one point by purple. Um, but look at that bonus. I think we just take it. It's too sweet. This is a crazy pocket to explode out of. Once I hold it, I'll hold it forever. I'll accept purple's alliance. I don't think purple caps on the two. If he does, he risks getting rolled turn one. It's a cool pocket to take, right? So I'm going to take the plus four turn one and then the plus six ideally as quickly as possible. And then we expand out, but we don't have access to our capital. Um, this board is incredibly pocketed up. So these two blizzards lock off. He does. He does neighbor cap me. <laughs> All right, I'm going to roll you. I'm going to fucking roll you then. Uh, maybe I take this turn one. And stack to pressure. Let's see if anyone goes in the Mari Nubium corner. All right. I'm going to leave the alliance on with purple, but that was just about the opposite of a friendly move. I figure white goes middle position here. Yeah. And, okay, we got some good play. This actually guards the plus eight. I think white's capital is the best. All right, guards plus four and a plus eight. I'm locked behind purple. So the play is either to roll their cap. Man, look at these blizzards. Okay, so corner through the launch pad, through the launch pad. The launch pads are the natural chokes. Corner through the launch pad, corner. Cool. Let's see how this all goes. It goes past Magenta's cap, but doesn't go through it. Okay, blue picks. All right. I really need perfect dice up in that top pocket. We get it. I guess here purple puts behind my capital or breaks. They should also definitely break. They don't want white. Uh, they don't want to leave it up to white. You want to, you want to neighbor cap me and lock me in a pocket. I'm going to do everything I can to kill you. Yeah, they do put behind. Emil, it's what's for dinner. Hit my one. Makes sense. Why wouldn't you be aggressive to me? There you go. Okay, so... <clears throat> I have to hold Mari Nubium Station. Um, and the rest of this game, I will be playing behind my capital. Um, if I don't hold it, I'm in a much worse way. But I just, I have to take this as quickly as possible. And my line to taking that as quickly as possible is to take this first and hope white stays good. Now, there's no reason for white to stay good. So I'm 50-50 on seeing white break immediately. White doesn't maybe know that my plan is to try and deal with purple. I have to deal with purple. I have no choice. I will be cap locked. I'll be card blocked. Let's see what white does. White takes the launch pad. I'm happy. If white tries to go for the high bay warehouses, I'm happy. Let me hold something. Let me pummel the stupid idiot. Thank you. Well fucking played. 
Yes, well played. So my next job is to remove Pearl from being behind me. Thank you, White. Even one turn of this bonus. Blue could still break. Everyone allied up. Everyone readied up. Still not a great open. We don't like being locked in a pocket, folks. It makes us nervous. Okay, Magenta tries to take some of the bonus he's capped in. At 15. Hopefully, we stay at 15. 15 is 5 plus 4 plus 2 for the cap. That's a good amount of troops to start. Blue doesn't break. Please don't break blue. Don't break, don't break, don't break. Get some purple out of that. Eh? Right, if we hold, we're happy. Good spot for blue, but blue and green are going to be natural enemies. No, you... Oh, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. He he rolls the 3-1 and he fails the break. I get to hold at least one turn. I know you're a piece of shit. Okay. That was key. That was key. I don't think I hold for another turn. But I don't think I need to hold for another turn. Fuck my dice. Purple under all territories. White says heart. Thank you. I love you too. <laughs> I'm just trying to hit purple. <laughs> and then you can fucking have it. <laughs> then you can fucking have it. Yeah. He sees what happened. Purple putting troops exterior. Mm -hmm. Looks good. I'm going to fucking kill you. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to make you die. If White actually lets me stay behind him, then we can trade forever. White and I will go first and second this game. I don't know that he's good enough to see that. So far, he's played well. Not removing. Not understanding that I'm using that position to pressure. Fuck you, green. <laughs> Why are you trying to hit my shit? All right, does white steal now? Or does white continue working on the high bay warehouses? He does keep working. On the high bay warehouse. Okay, I lose three territories because of this. We'll be down to 15 again. As long as Magenta doesn't hit any more. Blue probably will. Well, it looks like white is the homiest homie. Blue probably can't afford the two troops, the three troops to a break. Not if he's going to try and win his position against green. The fact that he lost a 3v1 is key. Let's see if blue puts any troops up there. He doesn't. He goes for a plus six. I 
hold that bonus again. Okay. Yes. All right, purple. I hope you're shaking in your booties. I've put zero troops behind white. White should be happy about this. White and I go first and second by the looks of things. I am punching through your fucking capital, sir. Emil, it's what's for dinner. <laughs> oh yeah, you know I'm attacking purple. Oh, yeah. <laughs> A 100 fucking percent, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is good for white. White doesn't, have, White doesn't have enough troops on his capital. Oh my god, sealing White's cap here would be so cruel. <laughs> so cruel. Oh my god, I'm thinking about it though, because I'm a huge piece of shit. Oh my god. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to betray this homie. But I fucking could. <laughs> oh. I can take a, actually take a fourth card and skip. Who steals the green cap? Can I get back there? Can I get the blue cap? Do I let these guys just fight it out? I think I need an exterior position. I think at this opportunity, it makes perfect sense. Now I'm not card blocked. I'm not touching you, White. Yep, White understands now. Yeah, hit me, for sure. Yeah, for sure. You did. You did your fucking duty, sir. You can take that, that piece of the board now if you want. I think, okay, green sets to pop the other cap. And loses all the troops. This could be really good for me back there. This could be really good for me back there. All right. White adds to the seven. Cleans the pocket. No, takes the other cap. Ah. Smell your later green. Well played. Guess you're dumb and you're dead. We'll miss you. Okay. I like Magenta's game, but they haven't really been able to capitalize on anything. Um, me and White have a fantastic working relationship. set in some sort of desperation to keep themselves alive longer. Could go to five. I don't think I need to. I think it makes sense to skip here. Maybe not. Magenta says, I love you, top purple. I love you too, man. All right, I'm getting 22 a turn. <clears throat> I don't really think I need to do anything, frankly. I want to keep the sets low. So I'm generating the most. And I want to I want to keep the fixed capitals portion of this game longer. 
We see a 5 or 3. A 5 or 3 lands. Green says to Blue, you're not recovering. <laughs> you're not recovering. I'm going to make sure you die. And I don't blame him. Okay, so if Blue doesn't have a set on 4, I kill him on 5. White getting 19 a turn, matching me. Me and White should go first and second. Very happy for White to go second with me on this board. Does he also skip? I'll take the blue kill here. Okay, he takes it. He takes the pocket. Does he preserve the blue kill? That will actually kind of piss me off more. I understand why you did it. But that means I, I'm going to take this. I'm going to take this plus six, right? If you want that, then he, he doesn't actually take the blue kill. That is fucking sneaky, but the cards aren't worth anything. Ideally, blue sets here. I'll just remove him from the left-hand side. I don't care if white can get an early kill. Don't think I care. And purple's going to continue to be annoying um, on magenta. But purple has lost. Purple made a terrible cap choice and will now be directly punished for it. All right. I think I just removed blue from the left-hand side. Or do I keep skipping? Hey, Blue, remember when you tried to roll my cap turn one? Do you remember? Because I remember. I remember when you did that. Yeah, I, I remember when you did that. Ah, uh, yeah. Sorry, I didn't try to roll my cap. He tried to break my bonus. It's equally offensive. We were, just <laughs> we were just eating up this board, me and white. Okay, Perpy's still fucked. Ooh, Perpy goes for the white cap? The magenta cap. Purple's so bad. All right, they're just a new. Poor magenta, though. Poor magenta tasting the wrath of this asshole. All right. Magenta is pissed. <laughs> All right, I step out. I hold another plus four on a one point. Maybe I eat magenta. This is a crazy game. This game is fucking amazing. I love it. You're going to keep taking cards until they can't. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get you out of there, too. I don't want you taking cards. White gets 25. At some point, white gets scared of me, right? Or does he take the kill on blue? I'm going to ask him to hit blue. You get the kill on green. Let me have the kill on blue. I will feed you the kill on green. Either way, I actually don't care. Sats gets the 10. Are we lining up to kill green and blue? It's also possible. No. We're going to kill neither. We're going to feed green? Feeding green is fun. Watch him leave like a territory back there. Yeah, feeding green, but not. Magenta has a set. If you take that one, you get popped. Take the nine. I will be hitting that. I will be hitting that. I will be hitting that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just so you know, Magenta, if you want to ensure yourself a lower placement. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Attack purple. Yes, I will. I will be killing purple now. All right. Got it, bud. Purple gets lowest. Couldn't happen to a nicer guy. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> what a dumbass. <sighs> All right, let's see who's got cards. My board position is very good. White's board position is very good. White is trying to farm kills, which he shouldn't be doing because the bonuses are still worth more. So now I'm going to take everything outside of White's capitals and kill Magenta. And then we're going to go into the 1v1. And he can take those cards. White breaks me here. No, he kills green. White's killing green. Okay. Does he also have magenta? Do I have a set? No, I probably don't need one though. I think I kill magenta without a set. Unless white breaks the shit out of me. Is this the moment he chooses? Kills blue. Sets again. Yep. this does he also take magenta great game why does more troops than me yeah maybe he's got me i don't know i have a really good one point but so does he his one point's worth more than me maybe he's maybe he wins maybe this is the power of friendship folks you have to kill magenta if you're white He's not doing it. His caps are now locked. Okay, well, it's a relatively easy card block. <clears throat> but the bonuses are worth so much still. Okay, 43 takes my cap? No. 43 goes back to cap. Please no set, please no set, please no set, please no set. Let me kill you. I need to kill you. Oh, fuck! <sighs> All right, so magenta is good. I get the vibe that magenta is good. Magenta being alive in this game is an interesting factor because it will delay the moment in which White and I go bad to each other. Magenta having set on three here is the most clutch thing you've ever seen in your life. But I get 35 a turn. Give magenta cards. Set. Can I do a set here? I should punch through on the left hand side, actually. Okay, white takes the 40. Do they go for magenta? They go for cap. No, they put all their troops on capital. Okay, good. It's gonna be a spicy 1v1. White has a buttload more troops than me. He took a risk, it paid off. I don't think I can afford, oh, he does take that cap. Yeah, doesn't take it. Cool. There's a stack out. He's gonna also take magenta on three, but I have, I have first, uh, I have first dibs on that kill.
It's 40. What am I getting in turn? White sets. I just threw my stack to kill Magenta on two cards. Yes. Okay. No. What's that? Great board position for you. Unbeatable? Is there a place I can trade with Magenta? No, because they don't have a capital. Yeah, that might be that. Give Magenta Capital. Cards are everything. The board matters a lot. I need Magenta to work with me, and he's going to play to win because he has so far. White's going to kill him and go into heads up. I think we lose. I get second here. I'm set. Set's 55. There's no real way for me to punch through into white. Caps are locked, which is a good thing. Do we card block him in trade? Is that a world that exists? When a man's getting 60 fucking troops a turn? <laughs> Probably not, right? Not anytime soon. Yeah, I think that's a win for white. Hmm. Looks like the kill guarding did pay off. So the agenda goes to four, I can kill them, lock in second. I think I have second anyways. Do we see a line of play for first? Good for Magenta. I hope Magenta, I hope you fucking win this game. No, I hope I win this game, but I hope <laughs> you. Oh shit. Hope Magenta gets second. Now it's anyone's game. Ooh, we pull a joker. Well played. Thank you. Thank you. What the hell's wrong with my mess? All right, this gives me a chance. White and I have inverted our position and spent a buttload of troops on each other. I hope you get a capital, Magenta. I hope you get a capital out of this, sir. A three-player game is exactly what I need right now. <laughs> I 
Man, that, that lucky set on three. I would have killed him and it would have been a totally different game. We're splitting? Or we're going to let Majetta sit on a capital? <laughs> yes, we are. Yes, we are. He doesn't have a set. He doesn't have a set. Dude, at least take the cap. At least take the cap. If you don't take the cap... In order to take the cap... Oh, please take the cap, dude. What are you doing? Oh, my God. He goes to five. Fuck me. I don't understand not taking that cap. <laughs> okay. At least that roll goes my way. What's the set? 60. Yeah. Magenta gets a cap again if he wants one. He's choosing not to. Which strikes me as odd. No, I'm a super easy card block. That's the thing, right? Playing to win there meant that I risk third. I might get third. Not be a fucking debate. Hit him. Magenta's playing dumb. But he is not dumb. Attempts to card block? No. Not yet. This game is fucking crazy. Forty six sets gets the sixty five. Yeah, that's the key cap. Now, this is the cap that decides who kills Magenta. You need to put more troops on it. Mm, tries to car block me. He does try to car block me. Okay, so White wants to give the win to... Well, White wants to give Magenta second for some reason. Oh, 
Well, I'm not worth it. I'm going to be taking cards. <laughs> Just insist that I die for no benefit? That's teaming. Right, there would be no reason to do this. Oh, that's why. Hmm. Damn it. Forgot about the cap run. You know, when, <laughs> when someone's playing, you expect them to be sitting on a capital. This guy was a master. Holy fuck. All right. Weird, 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 weird. Three masters in that game. Well, that sucked. Hope you enjoyed. So, ladies and gentlemen, in summation, um, despite games like this, which I'm pretty sure just obvious instances of collab, um, or something earlier like the game where um, I pretty much had the win assured, but I m just missed a split. Notwithstanding, I, I don't think these settings quite have what it takes to be uh, the new miss, the new risk meta settings. I think they are good, but they're not quite good enough to be evergreen. So. We're going to take a break from Spaceport Sagma for now. Um, this is the end of this specific series on this specific settings, but I'm happy to revisit the map, and I'm also happy to um, take suggestions for what you guys use to grind with. If you guys think you can uh, give me settings that uh, would work on a 90% plus win rate, um, I'd be very happy to check them out. So... As always, feel free to shout out in the comments what you guys use to grind, um, and if you recommend I give a shot to some of those series. Um, we will happily revisit Spaceport Sugma again at some point in the future, but I do not quite think it has what it takes to be the next Risk Meta Settings, folks. And that is it for the series. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you're interested in getting better at the game of Risk, I invite you to subscribe to the channel. Come along the ride with me. I have a daily release on YouTube. I do weekday streams on Twitch. And for all of you on the path to world domination, good games and good luck.